What can I do? Ah, I know what I can do. Pull. That will then switch the track so that the train diverts. Oh, shit! Well, open that then. Fix around with that. Find the tool to cut those wires. No! Where the fuck would I get that from? Please get me out of here! Have you got a tool? Get me out of here, Max. Uh right. Hang on. Max. Where the fuck do I get a tool from? Oh, for fuck's sake, I hate this game! Ah! Aha! I've got it! 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 Oh, fuck no! Alright, we're good. We're okay. This isn't an issue. Oh, just jump down! Wait, 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 wait. Why am I in the floor now? Oh, Christ on a bike. I would, but I'm in the floor. What a load of shit this is. Can't even get over. Oh, my God. Just phasing through things. Yeah, Ace. Oh, shut up. I don't even care now. Go and die. Crowbar. Hang on, hang on. Oh, let me just cycle through the hundreds of drawers. Hang on. Oh god, I hate that scream. No, 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 I don't want to see I get hit. Pliers. Oh, I don't know! Yellow! Oh, fucking kill me. Oh my god, you need to shut up, red wire. Now that's the right cable. Fantastic. Now pull that, pull that, pull that, pull that. Yes, I did it. Oh, going! Oh. This game okay. freaks me out. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. Fuck off. Don't you dare sit on the train tracks ever again. I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot. It was cool to spend time in your lair, but I have to get back to school before my next. Oh, I've got a headache. You're the mysterious superhero. I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last. That's okay. We will forever. I've got a goddamn fucking headache. Oh my god, that was stressful. Don't you ever go near a train track again, or I will, I will hit you with my own train. Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. God. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. Explain what? Snow equals the ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? You're high. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours, and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? Five like the years butterfly ago, thing, asswipe, isn't it? Some people change. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar. Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. What a 
I like about this game is it tugs on your fucking heart. Like, I actually felt like I was going to lose Chloe in real life. Oh dear. Oh dear. It's all very glum. I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wondering. I'm not going to speak to that principal because he's a fucking cunt. Into the world party. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. I do. I'm not anti soiree. You seem anti fashion, though. A Vortex Club party has a strict dress code. Do you even have a dress? <laughs> Sorry, but nice try. Not sure what. Hey, Courtney. Ciao. Wait. Really? Oh, like you. Can... Dress code. I'm sure the Vortex Club has a dress code. As you can see, I would need your advice on what to wear. Thanks, Max. Huh? Huh? Turn the volume down. Tell you what, I'll put you down on the guest list and before the party. <laughs> I never sneeze in my life, apart from when I'm recording shit. Oh my god! Right. What did I just say to her? Have I booked something? I don't know. You holding hands? You're with Zachary. Juliet is laying the smack down on Zachary. Have they broken up? I'm really confused. What's happened? Hey, Warren. How you doing, mate? It's good to talk to you. How you doing? Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. Oh dear. I need help with this. Game. I'm not good at science. Don't do this. Need for help means you're exactly. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Potassium, because bananas. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but go potassium. Potassium it shall be. Go potassium. This works. You get a free hug. I'd rather not. I hope it doesn't work. Weird science. Yay! Bye bye. Where are we going? You can't help me. I'm trying. But you have to understand my position. Kate, what's up? Hey well, Kate. You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Nobody. Kate. Kate, Kate, stop, 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 Kate. What do you want from me? Kate. Kate, stop. Kate. Kate. Listen, babe. Listen. Okay. Please, leave me alone. Oh. What the fuck did you do to Kate, you monster? Probably slept with her like all art teachers. Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. But you know this. So what can I do for you, Max? Just between you and me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. Yep. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My oh, I could have taken a picture, couldn't I? <laughs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Yeah, I could have taken a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max, I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? Yes, I do. Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? I have. Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. That was a private conversation. Not that I wouldn't tell you, 
This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. I hope so, Max. But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Madsen claims you might be as popular as he did, should I believe him? Listen, should I... Excuse me, Max. Hello? Yes? Uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. KK. You're looking at that before. Shit, am I, in, am I in the picture? Do you think Max will be pissed we're sitting at her desk? No time to talk, Max. Posing in progress. Like I give a flying fuck. Are you? Run to Mr. Jefferson like he gives a shit. Like anybody does. Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. Did you think we were best friends forever or something? Not at all, Victoria. Max is such an attention whore. You would know. Can I sit down now? Oh, please do. Take a selfie of this moment. Yeah, Max. So I won't forget you. I'm actually going to be really mean to them now. I'm not going to bother being the better person. I'm going to be really fucking horrid to whatever. I bet they've put, like, super glue on my seat or some shit. David taking photos of Kate. Now this is so wrong. I reckon David is the one that took Rachel Amber. Guarantee it. Oh great. You right, Warren? What up, Max? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier, and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say, and she. She didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit Maybe down. We have a lot to cover today, and so little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like you're giggling about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student or a friend. I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. Usually, people... No smartphones in class, Max. Sorry. Put that away. Sorry. People need something to judge, so they never take a good look at themselves. We can thank reality TV for some of that. In the end, we can only blame ourselves for participating. Who's that? I don't know who that is. Speaking of it's cool that Mr. Jefferson published his own little book of photo tips. Oh, so he did. Participation. There are a few souls here who have yet to enter a photo in the contest. Oh. Like Max Caulfield, for oh. example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying chiaroscuro. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Although we don't technically see in my Yo! Some crazy shit is going down at the girl's door! Oh, Zachary, shit. do not come into my class like that ever again. Listen, everybody remain seated. Dismissed. Oh dear, what's going on? Is it, is it Kate? Oh shit, what happened? Oh no, it's Kate. It is so Kate. Kate! Oh my god! No! Oh, god. oh my god! 